Hey guitarists, I just want to take a minute to give you a really quick tip that helped me out so much when I was starting out on guitar. Thank you to John Crozier who taught me this when I was a young man. So, you, know, you all know your G chord and you know your C chord and you know that they appear together in countless songs. But it's a bit of a pain in the ass changing from G to C quickly because you've got to turn your hand right around. But if you play your G chord with your second, third and fourth finger, leaving your first finger free, it's really quick to get to a C chord. And you can leave your little finger on that G note because C has a G in it. C, E, G, open G, C, E. Why not add that G there? Hey, where do we go? Days when the rains came. Oh, what's he doing there? Well, I'm just moving that same C chord shape up to the third fret to make a D chord. Please like and subscribe and keep plugging.